finishing the season in 2016, you know, I got injured, you know, with the oblique injury and hitting 179, that leaves a bad taste in your mouth, you know. So, you know, talking with my agents and, you know, they kind of brought to me, hey, we're just, you know, we got a hitting guy that, you know, has a couple, you know, different ideas on hitting that I want you to go check out. So, you know, I got a chance to go with Rich Shank and he pulled up videos. It's like some of my favorite hitters like Barry Bonds, you know, Albert Fulhos. And that was a big thing for me. I like to, like, see things and try things out. And for me, also, like, starting this way, I want to think about my barrel kind of going rearward first because all the greats, you know, they're not really, their barrel, their bat's never doing this. You know, like, if you watch Barry Bonds back in the day, you know, his barrel's getting in his zone back here, staying through his zone all the way through. And when that happens, now my room for error, I got this much room to work with. It's like last year, a lot of times, like, if I'm expecting 95 and a guy throws a 97 mile hour fastball in the outside corner, and he beat me, but because my barrel's in the zone back here, and I'm still getting my base at the right field.